one out. Sonny Gray today 12 strikeouts which matches a career high. Here's McCormick. He's seen Gray twice and struck out on both occasions. Strike three call. There it is. 13 strikeouts for Sonny Gray. A new career best. He threw it right at the target but he's got so much movement that the hitter just gives up on it and it just runs back over the plate and man does he be good today. It's the Southern California kid Max Free back in his hometown making the start against the Dodgers tonight. And you see his last four times against the Dodgers has been quite efficient. Season high nine strikeouts for Max Free. Another one. And guess what it's the curveball again to take care of Will Smith ten strikeouts for Max Free back in his hometown throws a masterpiece and he leaves with a five nothing lead after seven. Let's say Max is fully back now from the three month absence. I think he looks all right tonight. <laughs> Well, when he walked out of the dugout and started going towards the mound, and they got a big cheer in the ballpark when everybody saw he was going out there. He's never had a complete game. Two down in the ninth. Ninth strikeout. And this crowd of 36,050 now are on their feet. Now, and Webb's got to earn it. The lone member of the Rockies going to the All Star games in the batter's box, Elias Diaz. Got him! And that's the ball game. Ten strikeouts and a complete game shutout for Logan Webb. And this is a feeling he'll never forget. So that's out the window now. The perfect game ended in the seventh on that grounder to first that Olsen had the air on, and then Segura with the first hit for the Marlins. After Strider had gone seven and a third. 100 pitches now for number 99. Two down, two on, two two pitch. Got him! 13, a Baker's dozen for Spencer Strider, who was absolutely sensational tonight. And Zach Wheeler has been dealing. He came into tonight Zach Wheeler sixth in strikeouts eighth in innings pitch swing and a miss and there it is number 200 on the season for Zach Wheeler it's the second time in his career he has reached 200 strikeouts in a season as he gets Michael Harris swinging to start the sixth inning Adam came out of the dugout to get the ball for his 200 strikeout Zach didn't even acknowledge it tells you about what he's about. And there's the ninth strikeout of the night for Blake Snell. Uh, Ty Jake Peavy with four games, with ten or more consecutively. One and two to Rodolfo Castro. And Blake's pitch is swung on and missed strike three. A fourth consecutive start for Blake Snell with double digit strikeouts, and that ties the Padre franchise record. A 1 2 3 sixth inning for Blake now 10 K's and we go to the seventh bottom half of the eighth inning five nothing game Justin Verlander has been incredible tonight Verlander for the first time will have bullpen action starting behind him with this inning starting now two outs bases clear Dominic can zone the batter he grounds one to a Brayu nice backhand play Verlander covering he'll go eight innings tonight Justin Verlander has been brilliant. Two hits, no runs in eight shutout innings. And he's only at 90 pitches. And what has been so far the best start of Zach Gallen's career. And nothing from the manager. This is Gallen's game for the moment. He has never thrown a nine inning complete game. Ground ball up the middle. Perdomo's got it. Race to the bag. And Gallen's got the shutout. That's the ball game. Zach Gallen's first career nine inning complete game shutout and the Diamondbacks have taken the first two games of this enormous series here at Wrigley Field. What an exhibition of pitching we saw here today. That's a dozen for Burns. Corbin Burns showing some fierceness out there on the mound. Just aggression going right after hitters. Got him. Corbin Burns strikes out the side in the six. 
A Baker's dozen for Burns. 13 strikeouts a season high for Corbin Burns. Corbin Burns didn't have his great stuff early. But wow, what a performance. Garrett Cole is looking for his fifth career shutout. It would be his second of the season if he can get it. Not worried about strikeouts. He's worried about a shutout. Consistently from inning one now to the ninth inning. Kiermaier, Springer, and Bichette against Cole. He's been looking around a lot, taking it in the entire game. Ground ball to Volpe. This should do it. And it does. Yankees win 6-0. A complete game shutout for Garrett Cole. Brilliant in his last start of the season, 300th start of his career. Not only does he win a game, but today he probably won the Cy Young Award. Yes. I completely agree and well said, Michael. His second shutout on the season.